Hello everyone, my name is Brian Navachoki Cabello, and I am a realtor associate with Keller Williams Realty in Fayetteville, North Carolina. Today on the Local Historian episodes, we're going to be talking about the lovely mural dedicated to the Sanford Spinners, located in Sanford, North Carolina, right between Wicker Street and Horner Boulevard. Let's jump into it. Who are the Sanford Spinners, you may ask? Well, they were a minor league baseball team that played for the Tobacco State League, or TSL for short, from 1946 up until 1950. Within those four years of play, Sanford Spinners were responsible for winning not one, not two, but three championships from 1946 all the way up until 1948. Now even though this mural only has a depiction of one pitcher, specifically Howard Allman, the pitcher that led the team to victory, this mural is supposed to be dedicated to everyone from the Sanford Spinners team. On top of this, the Sanford Spinners got to claim their victories at none other than Temple Park, located in Sanford, North Carolina, between 7th and McKeever Street. This amazing mural that depicts a part of Sanford, North Carolina's history was created by the muralist known as Scott Nurkin. Scott Nurkin has a shop located in Chapel Hill, North Carolina, known as The Mural Shop. Now, Scott Nurkin was the creator of the mural. However, let's not forget about the generous sponsors who paid for it. Sanford Contractors, who have been in business in Sanford since 1969, providing construction services for residential, commercial, industrial, municipal, and state projects alike. With that being said, thank you for tuning in to The Local Historian. Be sure to reach out to any of these companies that we mentioned today if you're ever looking for their services. I've been your host, Brian Avachipi-Cabello, realtor at Keller Williams Realty in Fayetteville, and I'll see you guys next time.